Hi, this is Jonathan Dubois from Nutanix. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use AHV's built-in auditing system. This feature is enabled by default and can be accessed easily from Prism Central. Simply open the menu, hover over Activity, and click on Audits. The system will automatically log all activities performed on the cluster. Actions initiated via the Prism UI, CLI, or API will all be captured. Audit events will be stored in the system for a period of up to four weeks. For longer term retention, we recommend configuring a remote syslog server, which is covered in another video. Let's take a look at one of these audits. Click the title of the event. And you can see additional information about what was performed. So in this particular example, we see a VM was cloned. We see the user that initiated the action the source and destination VMs, which are actually linked, so you can quickly review them, as well as the date and time the action was performed. Any details about the action, such as in this case, all of the virtual machine configurations would appear here on the right. By default, the most recent events will appear first in our list. You can easily change the sort order by clicking on any of the headers in the columns. Or, if you're looking for something specific, you can easily filter these results. Click the filter button in the top right corner, and then choose one or more criteria to filter on. This will update dynamically, so you can just come through and say, for instance, I only want to see VM entities. You'll see that we've now gone from 71 to 34 filtered audits. Only show me creation. So now we're down to four. You can come in here and you can even say only things that contain a specific phrase, like clone. And these filters can easily be removed by just unchecking the box. And then as you can see, we're back to our unfiltered view. You can also create a focus, which will let you customize the columns that are included in your view. To do this, simply click Focus, click Add Custom, give it a name, and then choose the fields that you want to include. So Action Description will be there by default. But for my use case, I'd like to see user IP address, username, and the time that it was occurring. Hit save, and now my view's been updated. I can go back to the default view by just clicking on general again. You can also export all the events to a CSV file by simply clicking the export CSV button. So in summary, you now know how to use Prism Central to quickly review, search, and filter audit event entries within your Nutanix AHV environment. Thank you for watching.